Hey, what's going on everyone? Matthew from the right trader.com back in with another cryptocurrency video. Today we're going to be talking about Tron, which is one of the few cryptos that outperformed the market in the last uh, few days. It is actually up and this is in contrast to some of the biggest and best coins out there such as Bitcoin, which is down over 15%, Ethereum, which is down over 24%. Well, guess what? Tron, a crypto that has constantly been uh overlooked and undervalued is up over 15 percent almost 15 percent in the past 24 hours and is uh in the positive over two percent in the last seven days this is coming at a time where most of the market has crashed 20 to 30 percent easily right there are almost no coins except you know a few stable coins that are up in the last uh seven days so this is a very big exception and some of you might be wondering why well i can tell you it's not a coincidence uh that tron has been performing so well if we look at um the chart in the past year it had a few ups and downs but overall kind of flat well the fact of the matter is that tron is being severely undervalued as a layer one coin uh this is probably one of the best layer one networks right now in the entire crypto space i think it can fully compete with ethereum and others um such as bnb the the point that i'm trying to make here is that uh tron is a very usable network you may have used it to deposit to exchanges in fact the exchange that i use right now my favorite cryptocurrency exchange bit.com you can deposit usdt through the Tron, Tron network instead of Ethereum. What does that do exactly? Well, first off, it's much faster, right? You usually get it in literally like a minute. And on top of that, you barely pay any fees, right? I think it's about a $1 fee to send the transaction instead of uh, 10, 15, 20, $25 sometimes with Ethereum. So that is a huge difference and it's literally more efficient and uh, cheaper than to use the Ethereum network. So I usually, when I'm moving around USDT, unless I need to use the Ethereum network, I much prefer using uh, the, the TRC20 version of USDT to move that around different exchanges. Um, so that's what I've been doing for Bit.com. And in fact, uh, Bit.com has TRX, right? The token that powers the Tron network. Uh, it has TRX available for trading, so make sure to check them out. I'll leave a link in the description of this video. And there's also some very big news which came out about um, Tron, which is that it will now be uh, stabilizing and uh, launching a stablecoin. Now, this is a pretty crazy time to be launching a stablecoin. It could be seen as a good thing or a bad thing, but they are releasing their stablecoin, which is called USDD. We'll go ahead and pull that up here on coin market cap uh it literally just launched uh a few days ago and uh it, it hasn't been the most stable coin but uh overall it right it has been stable in contrast to things like ust um and that, by the way this is a pretty normal pattern when a stable coin just launches it tends to be a little bit volatile so um i wouldn't mind this too much and i mean really it's pretty much stayed right around a dollar the entire time um, I think that this stablecoin is going to do very well. I think that um, it is going to see a huge amount of money flowing into it. Now, I can't guarantee long term what's going to happen, right? We've seen how fragile some of these stablecoins can become. So who knows long term if this one will survive. But I think that the team behind Tron, Justin Sun, uh, will manage to stabilize this coin in the long term. That's uh, that's my personal feeling here. Now, they're backing it with things such as USDT and uh, USDC. Um, those are, you know, stable coins that are fiat backed. So they're using those cryptos to back their stable coin in part with other things as well, such as uh, the minting of TRX. Now, we've seen the death spiral that this created with um, Luna just this week, right? So we really have to be careful and cautious with this type of stuff. Uh, and, you know, time will, will, will show if... This is truly fully stable and backed algorithmically with their strategy. But like I said, right, the Tron network itself, uh, I don't know all the history about it. I mean, from what I've seen from when I've used it, it's been literally one of the most flawless cryptocurrency chains I've ever used, right? It's extremely fast. It's cheap to use. Um, it's pretty much flawless, right? Um, it really wonder makes you wonder why Tron is not in uh, the top 10. And actually, I think that Tron uh, will absolutely i'm very confident on this it will absolutely be in the top 10 in the coming years right i think that it's going to bypass polka dot i think it's going to bypass solana and i think it's going to bypass 
uh, Cardano and uh, BUSD. Uh, so probably, right, we could even see it starting to move towards top five here. Uh, and that is going to be due to various reasons. One of them, Tron is starting to really be battle tested here. And plus, it's performing well in a bear market. Second, they have their stable coin. We know that there's a huge need for stable coins. There's some issues with certain of them on the market. Some of them are literally dying as we speak, such as UST. But there is a need for them. And this is an opportunity to fill that need, right? If this is successful, uh, we're going to see money like never before come into the tron network come into usdd and that's going to directly start pumping the trx token right overall right in its history tron um i mean it, it got you know of course that initial spike higher but for a quite some time it hasn't been doing all that much which is a shame because um to me like this is this is the pinnacle of something that's being overlooked right now right such a good strong functioning network uh, at only a seven billion dollar market cap I would directly compare this to none other, right? You can skip all of these. I would directly compare it to BNB and Ethereum because that's really uh, the, the main competitors of this coin. And guess what? They're performing just as well in terms of their actual network, their technology. They're performing just as well as um, uh, BNB and Ethereum for cheaper fees. So I really do like this coin. I see it coming into this higher range. I see it reaching a market cap of over $50 billion. In fact, I could see this coin reaching over 100 or even $200 billion in market cap. Let's look at where the market cap is right now, 7.5 billion, a 10X getting it to $75 billion. I think that's a pretty reasonable estimate. That would bring the price up to around 70 cents. And really, right, if we reach 70 cents, we're likely gonna reach a dollar. Um, that's typically how these coins type to, like to move. Um, so I think that, you know, reaching a 100 billion market cap for Tron is absolutely possible. Basically, that's sort of my price prediction there is getting to a dollar. Um, you know, initial will probably make that move to 50 cents if USDD is successful. And then if uh, over time it's continuing its success, it's staying steady. People are seeing the value in the Tron network. I think we're going to get that move to a dollar. That's going to be a full 10x, right? Even over a 10x for Tron. Um, this is something that uh, could really start to eat into the market share of Ethereum kind of and head towards that 150 $200 billion market cap range in the longer term. I also like the fact that this is somewhat of a safer bet, right? Tron has been around now for a while, in fact, since 2017. And although it's had its ups and downs and has uh, kind of been sleeping, so to say, for a while and not doing all that much, well, behind the scenes, they're making massive moves here with the stablecoin launch and just the general success of the network overall. Um, I think a lot of people underestimated the the success of uh, of this crypto right it also has a bit of a a, a star founder uh, known as justin sun some of you might know him but he you know is the creator behind the tron network bit of a controversial figure however he is a very big figure in the crypto space 3.3 million followers on his twitter uh, and he's right now promoting a lot the usdd network which is their stable coin that we talked about um you know they're uh providing custody uh they are also you know, backing this uh, stable coin, uh, which is known as the Tron Dow Reserve here. Well, this is, you know, uh, they're explaining how they're backing the stable coin exactly. And like I said, right, one of the main ways that they're doing this is they're buying up a huge amount of USDC, uh, which you can see here, right, multi hundred million dollar purchases, as well as USDT. And as Justin said on his Twitter, right, this is literally exactly to back their coin right especially in a time where there's attacks against stable coins such as ust this is why they're putting in the money they put over two billion dollars now to stabilize their coin make sure that it's correctly collateralized um so this is what you see right here with these treats right the safeguard the overall blockchain industry and crypto market tron Dow reserve has bought over 200 million usdt average price of 98.5 um sorry 0.985 and, uh, you know, they did the, pretty much the same thing with USDC, right? So they're really backing their coin uh, as much as possible. And, you know, he's saying that this is going to short squeeze Tron. Well, guess what happened, right? It absolutely uh, did. It completely short squeezed Tron to the point where Tron is up in a very, very bad bearish market right now. This is impressive. I like this. And also, right, we've seen that Tron has mostly been stable recently. So if we start getting upside, I think this is going to start to fly, right? This is not a coin that, you know, is overvalued right now in its current state. Absolutely not. Some might say it's fair value. I would probably say it's even quite undervalued right now. 
uh at this current point in time tron should probably sitting somewhere around 20 25 cents and i could see that to be honest a move above 10 cents maybe moving up to 20 cents happening in the next three months um so very bullish on tron hopefully this gave you a good overview of sort of the future what we can expect here moving forward because i think people are underestimating this make sure to follow me on twitter for live cryptocurrency market tweets and also uh check out bit.com my favorite exchange i'll be leaving a link to both those things in the description of this video thank you so much for watching everyone stay safe and have a great day i'll see you next time thanks for watching